It used to be a military base. Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like 10 minutes. I'm listening. I can watch the hypnotic rolling of the waves and listen to you at the same time. Oh, okay. What did I say? Little Miss, I can see and hear things at the same time. The cookies are great on Edwards Island. Used to be great, but you passed. Thank you. So you all moved in? Um, not, not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a, you know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> no, what happened? Okay. No, wait, what happened? I feel like I haven't heard this. He got lost in some gardens, and he thought she worked there, and blah, 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 they hit it off. Aw, that's downright adorable. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um, I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? A, uh, second cousin? He'll be like a roommate, really. No, but isn't there, like, a term for it? Um, stepbrother, technically. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, there's an old ship's wheel up here. It's a replica from a Portuguese caravel, it says? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think the Portuguese discovered the island. I don't know. I mostly slept through the maritime portion of history class. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new... S uh, who's the... Uh, who's driving this? That's Sea Captain Karen. She's doing us a favor. You'll notice we're the only ones doing the voyage. How you doing up there, Karen? You did notice. Yeah, I, um, did notice that. It's a little hush-hush, but she's dropping us off and then doing a, uh, miscount on the way back. So we can spend the night. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic. Grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. Okay. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato blocks. Yeah, well... You don't see a man's toddler penis and not become best friends after that. <laughs> what? Yes, exactly. Bond stronger than oak. Passengers, we'll be arriving soon. Check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, wait, who's talking right now? It's a recording. They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like... Yeah, let's do it. And it's Jonas, not Jonah. Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. Jonas. It means oppressor, right? Yeah, but I mean, my sign's cancer, and it's not like my hair's falling out or anything. Here's good. <laughs> uh, whoops. There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Of course. Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mono from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. 88.3, Chicago. We spent five years. It's a... Which I played because that song's been stuck in my head since I woke up this morning. But, oh... Oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach, or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band, so hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. So in case you guys are wondering, this is supposed to be like an until- <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. We must be getting close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but 
Nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. So this game You'll is see. supposed to be like until dawn, I guess, with like choices and people die. I did try not to look too much at it because I didn't want to like spoil it for myself with trailers and stuff. Yeah. I wanted to be completely surprised. I watched a trailer, but I'm pretty good at watching a trailer and then just like wiping it from my memory. <laughs> Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. <laughs> yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh. No thanks. Uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off oh, me if you're empty. Fine. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. Last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. All right, We're heavily my other friend should be up and nice around the bed. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have, like, two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, really? Wait, is, is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. Let's just it's like a buddy system. Yeah. So let's be buddies. Um... Just never mind. I've already made everyone uncomfortable, so... No, it's... You're not making anyone uncomfortable, but... I mean, let's all just go up. We're like at hour one here. You'll have ample family bonding time. Uh, yeah, fine, sure. No problem. Oh, we didn't say it fast enough. Yeah. Okay, speed read definition. When the flag is flying, we are... funning. Um, I think it's supposed to say running. Oh. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down, and we, the Kamina High Junior Class, have come to commit improper acts. <laughs> improper acts. Improper acts? What? It's kind of kitschy. Damn it. Right? It's kind of kitschy. What? The town? I like it. I like kitschy stuff. It's like the opposite of ugly, scratchy nature. And the other thing is the weirdo caves. Weirdo caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like... The front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. You'll hear voices or just sound. It's, um, it's pretty creepy. At least I've heard. I did it once. It's amazing when it works. So, back up a second. Who's Mrs. Adler? Her family, I think, like, owns or owned some of the island or something. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call a local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. I can't imagine living in the Sorry, same exact to house, to looking at the same time. exact walls yeah. for that long a time. Well, it takes a certain someone. And actually, you know what? Speaking of the opposite of those certain someones, drum roll please. Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? Oh, really? So yeah, so... Alright, so what if I am? I don't know. So what if you are? I guess it's nothing. No big deal. I just... If you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. What does that That's mean? all. That's my whole spiel. What the hell does that mean? Nothing, nothing, nothing at all. Do what you want. Forget I said anything. Ah, oh, I forgot this was even here. So, this is cool. What is it? It's a memorial for a sunken submarine. Alex, tune to 102.3 so we can hear the guy. It's kind of a weird little, uh, like... Okay, sure. These are like real conversations where there's like it's no It's just, lulls. uh, yeah. 102.3. Ah, oh, can we talk? Long. I promise. Okay. <laughs> so this is supposed to be like until dawn, really? guys. It's... Uh Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15th, 1941 and commissioned into service at the end of that year. Its propeller was the Lieutenant one James thing recovered, Clark. so they made it into, like, a monument. The crew are listed on the plaque thing. War the is hell. The only prescription for war is war. I'm just exploring. Yeah, I don't know how much we're gonna get to talk during this. Oh, are we finally able to just sit in silence? Okay, so it's supposed to be like until dawn, I guess, a little bit, and you get to choose 
your relationships, I guess. Stuff. Man, they close up early. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. That's true. I think I like that the conversations don't give you time because it makes it more like a real conversation. How you just, you gotta say it or... Or you don't say anything at all. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like it a lot. I mean, it's not good for us Let's Players, but it's good as a game experience because that's how conversations are. You're, you, everyone doesn't just stop and stare at you until you choose what you want to say. Yep, and then afterwards you regret, regret everything. all the things that you didn't say. Or, or you, you did said. say. It's basically real life. It's just regret everywhere. I really feel like this game is going to blast off into space. <laughs> you guys really got to like play this game. And, like, the game right now, from what I see, only has, like, 30 reviews and stuff. Like, it's gonna be... Oh, it's... The beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not... Oh, here's the map. Okay. Oh. Every time we want to, like, think about something for a second. Yeah. Not... I mean, it can't be too difficult. I want to touch this dumpster. So I'm going to try and touch as many things as I can, but I feel like whenever I touch things, it interrupts the conversation. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. So I think that's our new our new stepbrother, and he has a crush on us, if I'm reading that right. Maybe. Like, if we just became step-siblings, and they feel weird. And they're like, this is weird! I have weird feelings! Really cute. Oh, uh, before we get there, I should I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Who's that? That's so there's this girl, <laughs> Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her, and I want her to be into me. So just you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining cool. or anything, all right? Deal. Ren, relax. Oh, what was the thing you wanted to say to Alex, Jonas? You can just pretend I'm like a stray dog. Yeah, what was it really, Jonas? If you have some deep dark secret, I'd like to know now before we're officially housemates. I'll just talk to you later, seriously. Man, I'm so like bummed that I didn't realize that I had to pick right then and there. Yeah. We took Go figure we probably totally screwed that relationship, huh? Well, I don't really want to have a relationship I hear with my stuff over there. So. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying I was about to tell a story. What was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, that can wait. I didn't mean romantic. Oh, right, okay. It just meant, like, bonding and friendship. Hey, we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas? Everyone. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new-in-town, fresh-as-a-daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Yeah, uh -huh. he's a cool guy from cool North Valley, so let's all try and show him a good time. <laughs> Just the beach and some beer will be enough, I'm sure. Wait, wait, wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... you her stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where is everyone else? Why is she Nicole being had so... That tennis I don't thing. know. And... There's nobody else coming. We're it. What? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? <laughs> That's wow. it. That's who Why is... That's the group. Clarissa, seriously, who even invited you? Uh, <laughs> I did. Ren invited Nona, and Nona invited me. Though... Begged me would maybe be the better way to put it. Uh, I didn't. I didn't really beg. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> hey, what about me? What about you? Okay. Oh, I get it. I'm not even on the spectrum. 
You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20 deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. Faster. We've been hearing about this for years, and now we're going to do it. This is going to be amazing, right? Yay! Right, guys? Yay! Awesomeness! Yeah! You know what? Maybe it's fine that we're only five of us. And I hope that tall lady who keeps smoking gets killed and is not, not talking about Stacy. Oh, I didn't even... <laughs> I didn't even know she was smoking. Yeah, I, it came out of my mouth and I was like, oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. I see how you feel about me. Well, Stacy just got red hair. That lady has red hair. <laughs> I know, I feel a little, you know, I feel community with her. I feel community with the blue hair lady. I got blue hair. Well, I guess they're teenagers. I can call them girls. Yeah. Um, so, so far, like, okay, so the reason why Stacy and I aren't discussing the, 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 um. Choices. The choices is because they go by fast, and they're also talking at the same time, yeah, so Yeah, and so if you don't, like, just pick it, then. So I'm trying to pick things that I think both of us would like without consulting Stacy. Sorry. <laughs> I, I've chimed in on the ones where I thought, like, oh, I definitely want to say that. Yeah. So, um, what do you think of the game so far? This is really cute. I'm, like, I'm really liking it. It feels really, uh, I don't know, distilled teen nostalgia. Yeah. If that makes sense. You know what? It almost reminds me of, you know, the, so the conversations, how they, like, flow kind of fast. It, yeah. You know, did you ever watch Gilmore Girls? No. Where the characters talk, like, super fast, and you're like, nobody talks like that in real life. And then I was like, well... It's true. It's just that usually in TV shows and stuff, they try to slow it down so people can process it. Yeah. So I, I like the, the, uh, how organic the conversations feel. Yes. They feel really, like, uh... So the, I feel like the writing, it's really hard for people to write organic conversations, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. So I think they did a really good job at that. Go to the beach. The, by the way, this was recommended to us by a couple people. So yeah, quite a few. Want to give them credit where credit's due, even Fire. though I don't remember their names. Man's great equalizer. So what's the, um, what's the, like thing to do here other than obviously go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger we should explore the island I mean if this is pretty much a one-time thing we shouldn't waste it hey where does that old woman live oh you mean Maggie Adler yeah nowhere she's dead what oh. yep killed over three days ago it was all over the news local news anyway set up this oldest fire. living resident hey we could go see our house it must be huge. She was rich. No, we can't see her house. There's a giant fence, and I don't want to tear my jeans trying to climb it. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. She's so cute. Like, and sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Truth or slap? What's that? We used to call it hippo, until we got tired of people asking, why is it called hippo? Because you get to yell, you're a dirty hippo, before you slap someone. You get asked a question. You have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good, uh, getting to know somebody game. Yeah, fun. An excuse to hit run. Hey, huh. I'm the truthiest truth, whoever All truth, right, let's uh, just get on with it. Wow. Okay, so, first, we're gonna... I'll start. Run. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Oh, boy. Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it. Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something <laughs> like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no. just say so. I mean, I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... Oh, I just boy. like her as a friend. That's that's all. He's lying. She's we gotta cool. push it. She's Do you want to be an instigator? Oh, liar? Liar! He's lying! He totally likes her! What? Alex, come on. What are you doing? <laughs> I knew it. You can practically smell it on him. <laughs> I'm kidding. Relax. Last I heard, he's still pining for Lindsay, his secret Canadian. <laughs> yeah, well, I have a thing for hockey, so. Sure. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Okay. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> uh, I just need to pause it for a second. I want to know the type of person that you want to be instigator 
or what do you what kind, I just so like, that I know what to do. I feel like do. we already have an instigator. That's Clarissa. Okay, so so I meant like not instigator as in trying to start a fight, but like no, he likes you. Blah blah blah, like that or like what kind of person? Just so I know in the future what kind of answers you want. Well, yeah, I mean, in the moment. Yeah. I, I generally wouldn't be the person who is like, yeah, he totally likes you. Yeah, but this is a video game, and I want to see the juice. Yeah. I, mean, <laughs> I don't know. That's, like, a that's a really cunty thing to do, I think. Okay. Um, the, uh, uh, so what do you want to be? A supportive friend? Yeah. S- passive supportive friend or active supportive friend? Active supportive. Okay. Sorry. Oh. Lay it on me. Yeah. I think about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Oh, please. I'm going to go with adventurous Shoot. type of... I can take it. Yes. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. <laughs> what? Nice. It's fun. Uh, it's funny. I don't know. Uh, uh, Mary, and Nona. Jonas yes. is family now, technically. So he's excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. It's screw, oh, Clarissa. Should have said that we... Okay, okay, we're going down the line. Clarissa... Obviously. <laughs> I'm trying to see if we can be gay. Obviously. Yeah. You're not going to call her out on that? No, I believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait. Wait, that means you kill me? <laughs> out of everyone here. You, you asked. Yeah. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Sorry, it, it just worked out that way, I swear. And I'm the only guy. This is Miss Anne. <laughs> <laughs> okay, settle down. I'm pretty sure so you can choose Alex's if you're turn? gay, right? Yep. I don't know. Lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great. Here we go. What's your favorite stuff? Nona. Oh, okay. Professor Snow. Um, Nona. <laughs> yes. Do you like Ren? Yeah. All right. Let's... Do you like Ren? Oh, Jesus. Can we just <laughs> stop with the whole me and Nona thing, please? Of course she doesn't. She barely likes anybody. She's like an amoeba. I'd like to hear this from her. Thank you. You don't have to answer. I like Ren like a friend. Like, it, uh, I mean, there, he's he's a nice guy. You're, you're a nice guy. And uh, we goof off and... Yeah, you know. Ta-da! All is right with the world. Oh, shut up. Um, Nona, you're up? Oh. Uh, Clarissa. If you had to get a tattoo, what would it be? Hmm. A chick riding a motorcycle on fire. Something evil. She didn't ask you. A better question would be, what would she get when the artist refused to draw two dogs eating a dead baby on her forehead? I'd get, like, a little ampersand on my ring finger. I think I actually am going to get that after I move out, so my parents can't say no. Neat. Clarissa's turn now. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything, you know? Unsure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm, um, Is there a question? Fine. Oh, sorry, wrong one. Clarissa. I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably what? gonna get divorced again. Oh. And wow. the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear why. I, I don't. I don't really need. What are you talking about? What is this even? What does this have to do with anything? Why did your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care why they got a Truth. divorce. Just that. You know why, Michael died and it broke everything and they couldn't handle it the end well now you know jonas don't die and everything will be fine okay clarissa what you know guys honestly i think i'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game wait let's let's not stop like this we should game's over ren i won and to celebrate i'm gonna sit on the beach and drink and maybe if i'm feeling spicy even take a nap maybe we could and that's exactly what nona's gonna do too what is your problem yeah man what is your problem clarissa Just what did we... What did I do to make you act like I ate the last piece of chocolate cake on your flippin' birthday? Nothing, Alex. You did absolutely nothing. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. Uh, sure thing. Sure, we'll grab ya if we find any, um... Island Bigfoots? Island Bigfoots, exactly. Let's try and be her friend anyway. Well, mm-hmm. I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. Nona, want to come? Uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? Well, like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. 
Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh, yeah. Is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Oh. Take me with you. Take me with you. Don't leave me with them! <laughs> Alex, you want to check out the caves? Yes. Or? Wait, no, maybe we should bond with the girls first. Uh. Well, if you want to, just let me know and we'll hop over. I want to talk to the girls first. Hold on. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just... <laughs> Oh, oh, I forgot. We never talked about John. You look relaxed. I am relaxed. What's really I want to be friends? Yeah. Or are you okay? What do you want to say? Are you okay? Are you alright? Did something happen today or something? Something happens every day. Damn it. Thanks for making the fire. Yeah, sure. Gotta put those owl scout lessons to use. Uh, thanks for the beer. Tell your cousin that was nice. Eh, she owed me. I lied about where she was so she could see her boyfriend, Richard. I mean, Dick. But you're welcome. Uh, so about Ren? So about Ren. Look, Nona, now that we're not playing that stupid game, what do you really think about Ren? You already know what she thinks about him. Honestly, it just depends what you mean. As a boyfriend? Yeah. Well, for God's sakes, it's obvious what she means. He likes her, right? Okay. Look, Alex. I gotta be faster, nice, sorry. and I know he's your friend, and you know whatever. But I'm just not in the mood for something right now. Um, so if you could just like tell him that, just so he like doesn't get his hopes up or whatever. Sure thing. <sighs> yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Okay, so I just so want to talk about the person you want to be because they go by so fast. Yeah. So how about adventurous? Mm -hmm. Um. Nice, but doesn't, like, back down to being mean. Um, if, if that makes sense. Yes, I think that we can be we can be strong and confident while still being nice with everybody. Like, we don't have to be, like, aggressive or confronta overly confrontational. Just kind of, like, trust, trying to, like, be not, not confrontational, but being like, hey, what's going on? That kind of thing. Yeah. And what do you think about, like, instigating? Not instigating, but, like being overly truthful I would say being truthful is good I think the one thing that's come up so far is that if if Nona is interested in Ren I, she's really not she's not I don't think she is I don't so think, I think she is so but I just want to make sure because when we're making choices I want to make sure that uh, I know what you want that's all yeah island living huh uh yep Look, I'm sorry about all that drama over nothing. No, nah, it's fine. Um, how are you doing? Um, annoyed. <sighs> Honestly, I'm kinda annoyed right now. Clarissa has a way of just digging her claws in, you know? Yeah, I feel like I kinda do know now after the game, but it's fine. Forget about it. I, uh, didn't realize our cell phones wouldn't work on the island kind of promised my dad I'd call him. He never used to be this, uh, needy, but since my mom died, he's kind of shortened the leash on me a bit. He's gonna be kind of pissed. Not a good way to start the move, huh? Yeah, I should have warned you. The technology here, I think they just got, like, mechanical pens, so... <laughs> oh, it's no big deal. Don't worry about it. I'm just gonna write him a text, so in case I wander into a couple of bars or something, he might get it. You know what? It made me think of like Harry Potter, where like wherever there's magic or like high uh, amounts of magic, you you just finished reading the books, right? Yeah, I didn't read all the books. Oh, yet. well, wherever there's like high amounts of magic, it interferes with human technology so oh. that it doesn't work. And also, they put uh, special uh, not curses, but like hexes and stuff on certain areas. So if a Muggle goes to that area. They automatically remember something important that they were supposed to do and then yes. they run away. Yeah, that's how they have the Quidditch World Cup. Yeah, so it's like, that kind of makes me like think like, oh, there's like magic here, you know? <laughs> Let's go to the cave. Let's hop this thing and check in with Run. All right. Let's do it. In reality, they probably just don't have a cell tower on the island. Come on. I'll push you over. I want to believe. Whenever you're ready. <laughs> so, the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it gonna be? 
Uh, ten. Super weird. It's Ren, so definitely ten. He gets excited easily, but he has the concentration of a goldfish. The fact that he keeps demanding we see it must mean something. <laughs> All right. I'm I'm Mulder hey, in your school. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. I've never seen the X Files. Oh. Eh, it's not your fault. I think somebody dumped pig's blood on her in a previous life, and now she just wants to get ahead of the curve. <laughs> yeah, probably. Thanks for uh, not ratting me out to Nona during the uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but you know you could have and you didn't, so thanks. Yeah, Ren. About Nona. What? Did she say anything? Because if she said anything, you should tell me, like word for word. Give her space, or does she's on a date? <sighs> she told me to tell you that she's not in the mood for a relationship. Man, I knew when Clarissa dug in that it would screw the whole thing up with her. Ugh, this is so embarrassing. Ugh. Uh, there's other girls. There's yeah. other girls out there, Ren. It's not like little hamster girl Nona is, like, the one for you. Seriously, forget about it. Yeah, you're right. Who cares? I'll get over it. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, me. I am... Me, me, me. Oh, wait. Actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. What? Those look like brownies. No. Brownie no, town. don't, Ren. No. Come on, Ren. The last thing I want is to have to chase your frail, screaming body into the ocean because you want to pet a fish or something. What? Jonas is gonna do it too, right? No. Jonas? No. I don't want to go. Sukumita? There's no one around uh, to take no care thanks. of us. No thanks. I'm with her on the whole not flipping out and drowning myself thing. Okay. Hmm. Oh boy. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before us always leave them here, so you know where to try and tune in the signals. So you're going to want to stand basically right around here. And just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Like, uh, if you're all alone How on an island... How will we know when it's... You'll know. Trust me. If you're alone on an island, you shouldn't all so be just taking pull out the your drugs. Radio. <laughs> yeah. Okay, somebody, at least the same Any amount day. of people who are getting high, should be sober. <laughs> yeah. While we're young, please. <laughs> like, first of all, don't do drugs at all. But if you're gonna be there, at least be the person who's smart, smart about it. Be smart about it. I'm gonna keep it on this station so we can translate it later from Morse code. Yeah. So, this is just for my recording purposes so I can uh, translate it. I assume this is Morse code, right? Uh, maybe? Sounds too fast for me, but... Yeah, but people are good at Morse code. You know how when people are like, bah, 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 and you're like, right, okay. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a radio station. <laughs> no. Oh, was that the... So, that was the thing. But maybe we might just have to go to a different rock pile. Yeah, I just wanted to, um... cooler than I thought it would be. This is insane. How... how is this... how can this be possible? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then, because I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes, too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they, they're fine where they are. 
Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? Uh, she dated my brother. She dated Michael for five seconds, like three years ago. It was for a couple of months, a year and a half ago. <laughs> Whatever, she never liked me. Not even then. I was always the little sister who got in the way, who she had to climb in through windows to sneak around. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... Whew. Brownies are kicking in. Did that make sense? Oh boy. You okay? Are you... okay? I think so. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. Um... I mean, I get why Clarissa's upset. If you want to bring it on over. But being... A, a mean person to the sister of the ex-boyfriend brother died. Yeah. <laughs> like, she's, she's like, I dated him. I'm like, yeah, but she's his sister. Like, and she, her yeah. family fell apart because of it. It's, this isn't about you, Clarissa, okay? Like, I, I understand that you're feeling pain, but maybe, like, chill out a little. Yeah. <laughs> I really like the art style of this game. Yeah. I'm, like, so happy right now. Yeah. I've been waiting for a game to really feel something about, you know? Mm-hmm. I'm glad. I feel like this is gonna be the new Life is Strange. Uh, it sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... Painful. It sounds... Like, painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? Yes, let's wander over to the Touch strange it. light. Touch there's it! There's like... This is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous... No, I see it too. I'm sure there is something in there. Like a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's go swimming! Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> if it's a pool, that'd be cool. I, um, didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> cool pool. <laughs> Fortune favors the bold. Yes, it does. <laughs> Bye. Wait a minute. Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here. Because We're going to leave. I think, oh, shh, I think I mismeasured the magic. <sighs> this is bad. People are going to split up, though. We... We have one of two choices. Go follow the person to the pool or sit with the... Usually you should stay with the person tripping, but whatever. Well, he's... No, he's stoned. He's not oh. tripping. Oh! Oh! I thought it he was a mushroom. He ate a pot brownie. I thought he ate a mushroom, an edible. Okay, No, he Sorry. ate a pot brownie. Which still, you know, probably shouldn't be by himself, but... <laughs>